hello welcome back to Sarah Reacts. So we're going to be watching season 4 episode 12 of Breaking Bad and this one's called End Times. Yeah I think this is the second to last episode of the season. I can't believe we've only got one season left. Uh, I am 100% watching the movie. I know I've said this before but it's just in case anybody's wondering. <laughs> so yeah last episode seems it's been you know it's taken four, four seasons to realise that it's you know his family could be in trouble. Just, I don't know why. I think I've said it before, but his criminal naivety is so infuriating that when stuff like this happens, I can't feel, well, obviously I feel a little bit of empathy for him, but I can't feel the empathy that I feel I should be feeling for him in this situation because it's all self-inflicted. It's preventable, very preventable, <laughs> by not getting into it in the first place and then, well, obviously there won't be a show. <laughs> <laughs> you know trying to be the big man all the fucking time <laughs> like he was a very low tier cog just because he had a special talent for his particular job increased his ego made him think he was worth more because you know four days he wasn't working and they found someone to do his job for him who knows that might have been really good might not even need jesse but it seems that gus likes jesse now i don't know i hope he likes jesse it plays into my delusion if he likes jesse <laughs> of their like little three amigos <laughs> of him, Mike and, and uh, Jesse. You know, talking about him being infuriated. Freaking Ted, oh my god. I can't believe it took criminals coming in to make him pay his taxes. <laughs> but I knew that rook was foreshadowing. <laughs> I fucking knew it. It was either foreshadowing or a blooper that they just kept in because they thought it was funny. But he's Ted. It's like, oops, <laughs> but Bill's back out was like, well, checks in the mail, so clearly they left him there and still sent it off. <laughs> yes, I'm wearing glasses today. I only have the chance to record after work. I'm not faffing with uh, contacts. <laughs> also, my fan's on because it's hot as fuck in England right now and the humidity is killing me. <laughs> but yeah, enough chattering. Um, let's get into it, shall we? So, oh, starting with the music we left off with. Oh, what's this? All that matters is that the rest of you are safe. And that's why I'm not going. With you. <laughs> Where was this thought? Three I'm the real target. But we'll all be safer and Hanks. That's no, Skyler, you don't know these people. Well, you don't those know agents people. outside. They're not going to just leave you here. It's called protective custody. It makes me laugh because he's been acting like they're danger. not. A dangerous organization this whole time. Only as a but at the Marie same time they are How because he lives for that danger. Or, 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 Junior, or, or Hank for that matter. I alone should suffer the consequences of those choices. No one else. Good. That's the first smart thing you said. You should have divorced him. Hank. <laughs> <laughs> It reminds me of that scene, you know, where he kept practicing there. <laughs> Is he waiting for somebody? Or... What's that? I... How hard did you even try? Or did you? Oh, shut up. <laughs> I don't know if it's teenage for me. If you and Steve would just make him come. Hey, what are you talking about? Just one man, oh. somebody. Still in the beans, eh? But I think Los Poyos Hermanos is a front for the biggest meth distributor in the Southwest. Oh my god. Steve. Oh my god. Are you, are you even looking into this? I don't know why I'm on Gus's side in all this. Like, I'm so worried they're going to find the lab. <laughs> what is wrong with me? <laughs> I'm always on Hank's side. But I'm also on Gus's side. Oh, hello. I suppose this is probably why they've got the, um, the pressured hallway or whatever. So what are you going to do? There will be an appropriate Are they all going to be from Seoul? Get over here, stat, pronto. Don't call, just get over here. 
Take a break, HT. Let's go. You're gonna stop calling me. Right. I'm gonna hang you by your tie. Right and everything. Yeah, yeah. Stop showing off for the client. Honey tits. I say it's endearing. What's that mean? And why the hell are you dragging me down like for? You want your money, don't you? I assume that you do. Oh, that couldn't wait. Hey, listen. Do me a favor. Would, would you put in a good word for me with Frank? I mean, just for old time's sake. <laughs> I can't afford to put a clock right here. What's wrong with him? What's he talking to? You? What hospital? in my back this morning. The last time I saw Brock was last night. And this morning, I switched the cigarette into a new pack. There's no way Brock took it himself. Jesse, you're not well, thinking clearly. Right. Listen, you said it yourself, that you had it this morning. Yeah, yeah, I went to his office. He called me and just had to see me today. His big man mountain bodyguard patted me down. That's when he Didn't must have sold off. Well, say the rising takes That's the plan, like was that the days. plan? Admit what you did. Admit it! I did not do this! Shut up! Oh, stop lying! I'm not, I'm not lying. I'm not lying. Just listen to me. Listen to me. Look what I have to get. What possible? Possible? Could I, who? Who would? I'm gonna be like, this Gus. <laughs> hey. Stop laughing! Conspiracies. <laughs> Who's okay with using children? Jesse, who do you know? Who's allowed children to be murdered? But he manipulated you into pulling the trigger for him. Yeah. Well, you are manipulating him right now. <laughs> no! You don't even believe that! Gus's cameras everywhere, please. Listen to yourself! No, he has known everything all along. The cook and you have proven. To be honest, even I don't know. All out without me. And now that cook has reason to kill me. Hey. Oh, I'm going jump a little bit. Need to go to work. Now. I told you I'm not going. Oh, God, Bree, stop doing this to me. Absolutely, the child. Come on, I'll take a the leg on them. What a thing. Is he making a pipe on? <laughs> you bastard! <laughs> oh my god! No! Stop it! <laughs> Make sure he gets. I don't think it was Gus. I feel like Gus. Can be subtle with his threats, but don't be jealous. He, he lets you know. You're appearing louder than the 
the show. He was watching him. Does he put like a bomb in his car or something? Can he, does he know something's wrong? Keep going. Why did you stop? Season 4, episode 12 of Breaking Bad. Yeah, I don't know. I don't think, if I had to cut off one of the choices, I don't think that Gus poisoned the kid because I was thinking about it when Walt was saying, What would I get out of this? I think if someone was to gain something more out of this whole scenario, it wouldn't be Gus. Because Gus wants Jesse on his side 100% and I think it would be too much of a risk to do that to the kid because Jesse would think that. I don't know. It was the way Walt said that Gus was 10 steps ahead of him. <laughs> so I'm trying to think ahead of him. <laughs> I'm not smart. Because <laughs> I've said he is poisoned that either the kid took one of the cigarettes and was like smoking it like a kid does or it was Walt for this very reason but I'm wondering if Gus has figured that out as well so now he's going to be extra cautious and not want to do you know go to his car and all that stuff because surely they would have had eyes on Walt because <laughs> that whole time Gus was standing there I was just imagining Mike coming up behind him and being like hello Walter you know he goes I don't know I don't know I'm still doubting it all <laughs> I don't know. I wonder where they're going to go with the finale. I can't believe they fucking got me again. The jump scares are going to be the death of me. I swear. <laughs> it's just so rude. <laughs> I don't know. I am excited for the finale, but I don't want any of them to die. That's my like biggest fear. One of them's going to die. My worry is it would be like Mike or somebody. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. Um, but yeah, so full length and early access available on patreon.com forward slash it's and I'll see you next time.